Mm-hmm. We're trying to do a, our due diligence. Oh, I'm a man. I can handle my own business there, pirate. and serve those boys 120 months apiece so uh for treason i mean i don't i don't need that type of tension there i, I mean you know, see what you mean you don't know you're rolling under no name to fall down exactly exactly that's why that woman just talked about your head up there better be safe them names are attacked now i don't know where they at i haven't seen them around I haven't even seen them around in a while yeah i haven't seen any of them Yep, see, huh? Well, they've been out attacked, so I mean, if you ain't been attacked, you probably won't be seen. Well, I was told to stay like out of the like north, so I have. I, uh, mm -hmm. well, I, yes. I let the going oil through. You know, nice talking to you. Best of luck with the knife. All right, yeah, got it. Get your ass on now. Get that gun away. Oh. You, sir, not very nice driving boogie. Clarence, you're talking to the man down there. Oh, oh. Uh, Clarence, uh, don't touch me. Can I touch you? Uh, Mister, I knew you, you saw your doctor. Who is Clarence? Okay, who is Clarence? Because uh, I'm, I'm one. I'm actually the uh, the state provision physician. Your voice sounds like you have a lot of. You need a doctor really bad. And you still got that impression like you were a guitar player. You know, so the only way to shake that is to pull something out in your yeah. right hand. Okay, who is, who is Clarence? I'm going to you. There you go. Clarence went up, uh, Clarence went up to the reservation. Yeah. Does my voice sound wrong or no? Thank you, I mean, a bunch, a bunch of people just went up to the reservation. Oh, it makes sense. Sorry for yeah. a stupid thing. I thought you was talking to Whoever's horse this is, I'm moving it. I apologize. All right. You, you do that. You ain't moving shit. Oh. Oh. Not. It's one of those. Stuck I got an idea. Well, one, of those, one, of the, one of those maybe, creatures that don't like dominoes. Maybe they don't need to be touched. I'm a oh, doctor. Just one of those horses that hey, gets stuck out, in the mud. I'm touching it. Oh! Oh! oh. Yeah, that's what he gets. Oh, there it goes. Is that my dumbass horse? Oh, well, we the got doctor's office is up there. You might want to tend to your, uh, your bruising from the horse kick. One, two, three. I'm a doctor, not you. One, two, three. Hello? Hello? Okay. Hey, I think the man said he didn't want to be touched. One? I don't like being touched by no man. That's understandable. A lot of people don't like being touched. I'm gonna leave, uh, uh, if you reason. haven't noticed, I only surround myself with beautiful women. Let me know when you have work all day. Don't think of it. There's a lot of people. <coughs> no, you do I it. said, by myself. Yeah, there's a beautiful woman right beside me. I wouldn't be standing here if there was just well. a bunch of men around. It'd just be. What do you? Nah, what do you do that for? Do you? Don't you just stand around a bunch of men? It, <laughs> no. It, it wouldn't be like a group of your friends. Wait, those are hard-working men up there. Yeah, you know, nobody that, ever since the long period. The wars, them, them boys ain't been getting paid. How else are men supposed to eat there? Clarence, you look, them. you look great, by the way. Oh, thank you, Domino. You um, your shoes look. Fuck out of here about my shoes. I mean, 
Hey, hey, sir, you see his shoes? Oh my god, uh, we're not doing this again. Well, his shoes might be a touch him. Do you need to be touched, though? No, I don't need to be touched. Oh, oh shit. I mean, he, and he has been trying to touch everybody. Yeah, he has touched several men. All right, now you done? And on that note, uh, have a good night, y'all. Thanks for coming. Uh, I can take care of him. That was Raul's idea. How'd you like it? This man here, he, he oh, continued right. trying to uh, touch the people. Oh, let me see what's he doing down there. And then, then I see the fight. I heard you were married. Uh, mister, uh, you know, the, the law will not protect you right, if you, one of them, uh, if you continue, uh, touching the people. Oh no. Uh that good, huh? We're doing Clarence asked how we're doing. Fucking map. All right, sir. I will uh, rub hardly on your sternum while admin that strain the smelling salts. Uh, we must continue rubbing the sternum and. Uh, Maybe I must have to go get the uh, anal thermometer. Excuse me, I must try to uh, blow air into your lungs. Uh, allow me to grab a bellow. Oh, there appears to have a wound coming from the head. All right, hold on. your head with the moonshine and uh, shave small area and close the wound mm. all right we will have to try the uh, compression again and the air bellow Hmm. All right, well, uh, I 
this is this is disappointing. I reckon we must call the coroner. Sheriff, are you here? What's that, mate? Mm, the uh, the man that was uh, knocked out from touching everyone inappropriately, he has uh, passed away. Are you a doctor, mate? Yes, sir. All right. What was his name? Um, I I do not know. I um just got here on the train and uh, he was touching the women inappropriately and they they took care of him but uh, he is back here I uh, I sutured him uh, used uh, rubbing his sternum and the smelling salts but uh, to no avail Yes, he uh, he would not leave the uh, the the town of folk alone, always uh, touching. Uh, I'm I'm new here, so I do not know your procedure for the the people who uh, do not make it. For the deceased, mate. Yeah. Uh, let me uh, let me just. He's a body disposal of his and then head and dump his body out of here. It's fine. Alrighty, thank you, Monsieur Sheriff. Fucking European doctors didn't give a fuck to see a dead person back then. He didn't want to be saved. Sorry, Mike. I know you're probably busy. Um... I wish I had a sh I don't have any cloth. Um, I guess we could perform the autopsy. Yeah, doctor, and unfortunately, our, uh, a, a gentleman, Clarence, if you, uh, Clarence Haskins is his name, uh, black fella, uh, he usually takes care of um, our uh, deceased, but uh, if you catch him in town, he'll uh, come pick it up and just let me know the, the, the cost that he uh, charges for the service and uh, I'll uh, uh, pay you back for it. Or just mm. let me know and we'll call him into town and get these bodies out. If you got a little bit of ice, maybe just stick this body on it for now so he doesn't start to stink. Uh, may I ask for the uh, you call a legal permission for uh, autopsy? Um, well, I, yeah, well, whatever you're going to do with the body, you're going to dig a hole back and just kind of keep them but buried in a little bit of dirt just so the stink doesn't get too bad because then all of a sudden you get all the dogs in town. Oh, yes, I, I, I could I could take in uh, outside the, the town perimeter after finish. All right, mate. Sounds good. All right. Thanks for your service, Doctor. And um, hopefully we can have less of this going on. 
Yes, I, I feel not so bad because he, uh, what you call here in America, asshole. Right. Yes, everybody's got one. All right, thank you, sir. All right, mate. Have a good night. Okay, the uh, patient, mid thirties, male, uh, enlarged heart. Okay. All right. Uh, intestines. Last meal appears to be bacon, some raw fish, maybe cabbage, and uh, beans. Okay, uh, let's check the artery. All right, the arteries overly clogged with uh, cholesterol. Oh, this man would have had a heart attack in the next year already, so not too much loss for him. We take him to the graveyard. Here lies the man known for touching the people. I know not his name, but uh, they told him to not touch me. on top of that saloon a while back. I don't know how the hell it got there, but crazy times. Ah, mm. is. Mm -hmm. No kidding. The horses sometimes think they are the monkey. <laughs> yeah. Hey, the interesting going on in county, I just got in not too long ago. Oh, well, no, early now. No. Oh, yes, yes. Well, uh, there's that guy that tried to, uh, have you ever heard of uh, Jack the Ripper, the killer of London? Yeah, I heard about him. Well, uh, there is some uh, idiots that is trying to reproduce what he's doing here in St. Denis. Um, there is another uh, serial killer named the Hanger of St. Denis, that he, where he hang people. What the hell is wrong with people? I don't know, there's a group of people that kidnap Sodom for, uh, for money, I guess. Uh, there's a bunch of rebels. Uh, there's these uh, Cubans that goes around and uh, rob people. Uh, there's also the Mexican gang. But we haven't seen them in a while, so I don't know. Lots well, of different factions, eh? Oh, yes. There is these, uh, how do they call them? Uh, the witches. The witches. Uh, well, I have heard of the witches, but I did hear about them. Yeah. Well, they have a shop in San Denis, so I don't think we should fear them. Yeah. Uh, and the witches, you like the practitioner of uh, the voodoo? Oh, uh, yeah, they do some uh, voodoo things, rituals and stuff. They, you can go ask them at the shop in San Denis, they sell some uh, potions and stuff. Interesting. Yeah. Might suck at some point. <clears throat> and uh, other than that, well, uh, not really much going on. Is there I mean, a doctor in this town by chance? Uh, Duh, I'm the doctor. Oh, fantastic. Well, Would you got a doctor idea. Right 
But uh, yeah, there's a couple of Doctor and Valentine. Uh, now Valentine is a new Alexandria. I know that uh, uh, the old Doctor McKenna is uh, most of the time by Stubby. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, yes, right. Master Kane, he, um, in Strawberry, mostly. Yeah. His, uh, his, doc his daughter, very wild child. I got you. Oh, yeah, the, there's a couple of things going on, but, you know, it's, uh, the Wild West, so... Something happens one day and the other, it's a new thing, so... Of course. Well, hey, partner, I appreciate you giving me the rundown. Um, and, uh, Doc, would you mind talking to you in your office, Doc? Yes, sir. Uh, one moment. Of course. I'll just go in and... Oh, that's the show. Ooh, no, 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 not there. No, no, there. No, I'm, I'm pretty sure you would rather go see the doctor than the, the, the jail cell. <laughs> yeah, there is. No, no kidding there, Doc. After you. Oh, thank you, sir. I appreciate you. What can I do for you, my friend? Well, Doc, I took a bit of a tumble on the trail and scraped up my leg pretty good. I was just wondering if you could take a look at it. Mm, are you able to remove your breeches? Yes, Doc. One moment. Oh, yes, yes. Okay. Hold on. We, uh... Let's see how deep this is. Are you able to move still well or no? I'm able to move decently well, it's just I'm starting to feel a little bit sick. You know, almost like a, starting to get fever or something. That's what I want to make sure it wasn't like, you know, infection or anything crazy like that. Okay, okay. Uh, so what I do now, I shall uh, right, uh, clean with, uh, well, we have no surgical alcohol. So I shall use some moonshine for cleaning it, okay? Oh, that's going to sting like hell, ain't it? Uh, yes, sir. If you if you're able, uh, you could fold your belt and and bite it. I'm gonna do that. Really? All right, here we are. Alright, uh, next I shall, uh, well, it, it's not very deep, uh, we could use suture, or if you would like, uh, we could just bandage it. I think it'd be easier if we just throw some bandages on it, Doc, I don't want to trouble you too much. Alright, alright. Sounds like some commotion going on outside. Deputy Sheriff coming through. Ah, uh, yes, maybe tonight be busy. Maybe. Alright, uh, alright, that should be good for now. Um, my recommendation for you, I shall give you a mixture of, uh, some herbs. I give you the, uh, the ginger, the turmeric, and the, uh, ginseng. Thank you, Doctor. I appreciate you. What do I owe you, Doctor? Alright, just uh, boil this uh, every day. Drink in morning and night. Alrighty, thank you, Doc. I appreciate you. What do, I, do I owe you anything? Uh, it, it's up to you. I'll give you all that I can. Sorry, partner. I don't have much on me right now. Uh, I have no complaints. Yes, sir. How may I help you? And then what's your state uh, can, you, can you take a look at my shoulder? I just got shot. Uh, yes, sir. One moment. Um, I if, if it removes from my memory, how how to find out my uh, ID, my citizen number? Uh, I think you have to flex your page up muscle, friend. Uh, it will be at the bottom of your eyes near uh, your money. Yes. Oh, okay, yes, yes. My uh, social number is 78. Thank you, friend. Well, hang on, I might be doing that wrong. Let me see. Uh, while you feel that, I, I'll, I'll check this other gentleman. Uh. Of course. Okay, very good, very good. You already have your shirt off. 
Okay, now let me look here. No problem. Thank you very much, sir. No, you want to look uh, at the back. It's where the uh, bullet uh, and uh, I think it went through though, because I can. S I'm pretty sure. Oh. It's my left shoulder. Okay, okay. Yes, yes, okay. One moment. Let me go retrieve me uh, forceps. If you want, you could uh, stand over by the the lamp, by the couch. Excuse me. Oh, no problem. Uh, no, uh, the uh, sheriff gave me permission for autopsy and I buried him in the graveyard. Uh, excuse me, are you skipping, uh, the undertaker there, sir? Uh, at the moment, the, the sheriff, uh, circa searched out the person and then gave me permission for that at the moment. Where did you take that dead body at? I buried them in the graveyard. Uh, there is no open grave, so you just busted placed them right in the damn ground. It's a damn shame. Don't you damn skip a step. The undertaker comes first. Yes, I understand, but uh, I was only following order from the sheriff. Okay, all right. First, I'll clean this with some moonshine, and then we will retrieve the bullet. Okay. Uh, and this probably will stink some. All right, now I will uh, use the four steps. To, to remove. Ah. Well, yes, there we go. Oh, forty five caliber. Ah. Would you uh, prefer to keep the bullet or no? Ah, no, if I was to take all the bullets, I got shot. In the Alright, so uh, you have uh, two options. I can either just bandage it or suture it. Which would you prefer? Oh, I'll go with the suture. Alright, one moment. Moving it out, you see. Okay. Uh, would you uh, want anything for pain, or would you just resort to uh, some heavy drinking tonight? Oh, I'm just gonna go with the heavy drinking. All right. Uh, if you have any, if you have any fever lasting for more than two days, please do come back and see one of the doctors. We should, we would give you some some bark for the fever. All right. Thank you, sir. I hope you feel better and. Uh, Please do remember to file the report with the sheriff. Yeah, uh, I think the guy's dead anyway. So. Oh, okay, okay. All right, thank you very much, sir. Would you uh, want some help putting your shirt back on? Come again. Would you uh, do you need any assistance uh, putting your shirt back? Yeah, sometimes there's strength in numbers. Mm. Mm. Mr. Clarence not very happy the sheriff told me to get rid of the body, was he? I think I'm just gonna go with this from now. Yeah, he gets his job, so you like to be the one doing it. Uh, yes, I think the sheriff was just worried about the corpse smell. Yeah, the thing with the DVDs is that they give permission to some star, but they don't think rather than what they what uh, their own job. That's the problem with them. No, oh, yes, trust yes. Me on that. I'm a lawyer. I deal with them every day. Thank you, sir. 
No problem. I hope uh, you feel how better. How much do I own you for that? So my services are on for whatever you feel is comfortable. Oh, well, I got 19 on me, so 19 it would be. If that's all you have, I would only want to leave you half at least. No, it's all right. I got money in the bank. There you go. Oh, thank you very much, sir. Yeah, well, good night. You as well. My body's probably gone. Appears to be the lawyer. <laughs> Electric lantern. Story, sir. Can I get you anything? Uh, yeah, something stone. Say again, I'm sorry. Any, anything, as long as it's stone. I'll tell you what, I got bourbon here for a dollar for you. How's that sound? No, that's not stone. No, give me a whiskey or something. Oh, you want a whiskey? Let me see if I got anything here in the back. I think we might be fresh out. Uh, I'm gonna go uh, just on the way to put out my pipe. Put out the one. Now, I'll tell, tell you. Happens. I'll tell you what, fella. I got some vodka here. That's pretty strong. Oh yeah, well let's go with that. Uh, that thing. I uh, need. That'll still be a dollar, my friend. Uh, gosh, I'm out. Hey, Clint, can you uh, can you uh, give me a dollar? <laughs> fucking crazy. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I'll tell you what. In yeah, you are fucking crazy. You think Clarence ah! gonna give anybody any money? I'll tell you what. I'll tell you you know, here. I how about this? I I give you. Yeah. I'll give you twenty dollars, and you take care of everyone. Doesn't have weapons on the back like this. Well, but he's telling stories. Story, he's telling stories though, so it's finish. all right. You, you rudely interrupted oh, sorry, fella. You'll sorry. get to my yeah. horse, motherfucker. Yeah, sure. You didn't let me finish before I was finishing my uh, introduction. There. Of course, sir. My bad. No problem. I'll, I'll wait till you get back. So. All right. Thanks. No problem, sir. Sorry about that, Doc. Didn't mean to bump you again. Do you need anything, Doc? Oh, uh, no, I was, uh, you know, I'm new here, so I was going to give you $20 to take care of all of your patrons for the evening. Oh, goodness gracious, you are. You're a wonderful doctor. I'll take you up on that. I'll start buying shots for everybody. You want to do that? My, uh, state pocket is 67. Okay, just one moment. Yes, sir. Very generous of you, sir. And then what's your name? That way I can tell people the drinks around the house because of you. There you go, Mr. What? Thank you, sir. Drinks are on the house. What? Drinks are on the house due to this gentleman right there. Mm, Dr. Oh, Rotorio. Wow. Well, I didn't even hear that. I'll take five shots of uh, beer. Five shots of beer, alright. I, th I, th I think five, five shots of beer would only equal one beer. Yeah. You slam them down real quick. 
I mean, if you want to okay. just go with five shots of beer, just bring down a bottle of beer there to see. Alright, stop being I, uh... I was finishing my introduction. So, uh, what was your name? Um, I'm sorry, I didn't get that. Oh, my name, sir? Jerry. Yeah. yeah. Jerry Rhinebeck. Jerry. Yeah. That's right. Yeah, let me have back. a dozen bourbons and uh, five packs of cigarettes. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, hang on now. I said drinks. Don't be going too crazy now. <laughs> no, let me have a bourbon. Right there, Mr. Alrighty. Back. All right, we'll keep going until I'm out. <laughs> Got a rum? Who, who wants rum? Who wants rum? Me. Sombrero. You, you, I got you, fella. There you go with that good stuff straight from the Caribbean. Gracias. De nada, sir. All right, now, now, as you were saying, I'm sorry, I keep, I keep running around, not listening. Uh, oh, no problem. I mean, problem. he is uh, working, Clarence. I mean, I am too. Shit, that's what I was trying to let him know. If he wants to uh, help getting any bodies out the saloon, or of course, you know, if uh, you need the number one security firm in New Alexandria, Captain Field and Company, I'm an equal part member of that as well. So we uh, we protect businesses, we protect goods, we protect people and events. So if you ever need our services, uh, you can catch us up at uh, Fort Wallace. Just make sure you uh, mm. don't walk in or you get your head blown off. You know. Well, damn, sir. Thank you for the warning. I'll tell you what, you sound like a busy man. You got lots of titles, my friend. Yeah, yeah. I was actually coming to see if you had any dead bodies on the floor, but uh, looks like they all got cleaned up. No, we, we try to keep it tidy around here. Yeah, so on account of that, I kind of got to keep my uh, my shotgun on my back. You know, security and uh, dead people, uh, I like to trim them up, get rid of the uh, the arms and the legs and sometimes the heads and make more space for my wagon. Um, if you have to need my services. Uh, we always got the wagon parked on the side of the sheriff's department here and every other city and town in the state. All right. All right, sir. I appreciate you. All right. Yeah, that's uh, I, I respect your policy and I actually approve of it. But uh, I just can't let go of this. Uh, this well, is my tool, you know. I understand. I understand. Yeah, yeah. And like I said, it's more of a try to enforce type thing. Obviously, I'm not going to be pulling a gun on anybody, telling them to get the hell out if they don't. Just right, right. Yeah. The less, the yeah. better. You'll end up like Strauss, then, and you'll go crazy, I'll and right you'll back. end up dead or something man, real quick. Grass, yeah. But I tell you what, I will tuck the shotgun in my coat, you know, secretly, so no, nobody no. gets disturbed by that. I do totally. appreciate that, sir. That means a lot. All right. No problem. Ugh. There we go, camera. Plus, Clarence is an awful shot. You don't have to worry about him. Ooh, that sounds like some jibber jabbering coming down from the other end of the island here, partner. Oh, he's true. He, he's right. He's right. Nope. He knows. My, my boy Raul knows me best. Yeah, I got bad eyes. That's why I smoke a lot of uh, wacky tobacco. I get out of strawberry. And, well, yeah. That's why I only use shotguns. <laughs> Shit. You come up close to Clarence Hass, you're getting your ass blown away. <laughs> yes, the, uh, the yep. shotgun. Very good for shooting. Uh, not very altercation a while back. accurate and uh you know ghost alpha what's up uh, clarence had nothing but shotguns on him and we were trying to shoot at guys like across a ravine <laughs> gotta get them repeaters fella yeah i had to ask uh roll for his pistol i actually just gave it back to him got it cleaned up by uh mr twining up there by the uh rl dalton gunsmith store good man you ever see him around make sure you get your guns cleaned up. and it can't be caught with some dirty guns now no of course not no, the dirty gun not be yeah. good for using. Yeah, I, uh, I try to keep mine clean on my own. Kind of weird having another man clean your gun, you know? Hey man, I don't like uh, another man touching uh, any of my stuff. I run the oh, maybe you'll see that. I just just toss it in back there with the rest of them. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. Maybe you have uh, had too much to drink, my sure. Hey, maybe you had hey, too much hey, to drink. I run you still got that shit in the back of your throat a little bit, just a little mm -hmm. bit. You were looking a little woozy there for a minute, just a little bit ago. Who, me? Yes. Yeah, maybe a little bit. Mm -hmm. Howdy, partner. What can I do you for? Howdy, fella. I'm doing fine. What can I get for you? Mr. No, oh, it's uh, Jerry nope. I'm doing <laughs> Does my voice sound weird? That's oh, fine, sir. Uh, you got coffee back there? I do, sir. I work right. fucking I'm coffee. Cup. Actually, sir, I apologize. I'm One, two, three. I I had some, uh, oh, Maybe not sorry. very yeah, well. I'll tell you what, though. I do have free shots on the house. Sure. Yeah. All right. I'll give you a shot of vodka. Sure. That good that stuff. 
There you are, fella. Yeah. Courtesy of uh, the doctor right there. Yeah. No problem, sir. Thank you very much, sir. No problem. Sir. Mm, my pleasure. Reference: Try to keep the weapons off your back in the bar. We're trying to keep as few weapons in here as possible. Sorry, Mister. That's all right. Nobody knows. It's a new policy. Map to oh, I'm on yeah, I am. Duty. I got my card up by the sheriff's department. I was oh. looking for some dead bodies. Oh, I, how y'all fellas are doing anyway? Y'all doing good? Oh, uh, yeah. this is a lovely lady right next to you, right here. Uh, she's no fella. I know, I know. I, I don't. Know. I just mind. say it in general. I'm, oh, yeah, right. I'm used yeah, to that. Right. Well, you gotta give just... her the attention she deserves now. Yeah. yeah, I know, sir. I know. What's your name anyway, sir? Oh, me. Oh, sir. me? Yes, sir. You there in the green jacket? Okay. Oh, I'm just normal, regular old Clarence. Nice to meet you, Mr. Clarence. Jason. Jason Kelly Carter. Uh, I am not going to attempt that last name, but nice to meet you, Jason. Yes, sir. What you do around here, Jay? Uh, well, I'm just trying to find the odd job, trying to make some money to get me a ranch once them bees start coming out. Oh, yeah, a ranch. That's, uh, you ever been out between here and, uh, what that place, uh, Strawberry? Em Emerald What's... Station. There's oh. a ranch. There's a ranch between here yes, and Emerald sir. Station. You can go check that out. That's a nice piece of property out there. You know, thinking about doing cattle drives like I did back in Texas. Oh, mm. yeah. I got some experience driving bull back here to uh, Valentine myself. Hell. Well, well, maybe one day I could hire you. Wait, you drove Shit. cattle? Yeah, yeah. Oh. I was just, just playing around. I wanted to try that. I just really wanted to see a bull run down this street and and, and go and kill <laughs> yeah. some people so I can collect the bodies and uh, Damn, you know, everyone be standing out be like, hey, look at that coming, and then the bull just come with his horn and put right in the heart, oh and there come God. plants right behind after, you know, cleaning up the body, you know. Would that not classify as the uh, indirect manslaughter? No, 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 no. I mean, if you dumb enough to stand in front of a bull, I mean. <laughs> Yeah, you're right. Probably not murder, but it's probably manslaughter. Yes, sir. What that mean. Well, I never so even heard of it. Rough, but I do have to get a move on. I gotta get some meat in for the crowd tonight, so I'll see y'all later, all right? Some all right. Guys have fun, you gotta mister. get some meat in. Yeah, I'm about to say, I know about women getting meat in, but... Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> oh, hell. Never heard a man say that <laughs> expression. Uh, yes. You want some free shots? No, I think I started that, so no that's my fault. Sorry, gentlemen. Well, I think you'll uh, start a lot. Of no, things. thank you. I really appreciate it, though. What? No problem. You're a wonderful day. You better watch your mouth. Yeah. All right. My mouth, all right. Mm. Where is he going? Take a nap. Where did the thing change? Changing. Bro, you got a brother? No. Oh, yes, but that's not him. Uh oh. <laughs> Hell. Yeah, I haven't seen my brother fucking shit almost a month and a half, two months. Oh, my brother's shorter than me. Hell. I haven't seen my brother in about three months. It's been a while since I've been in Texas. And again, it's been a while since I've been in New York as well. I have some family up there. Oh. You uh, get they, around. They work in stock? Uh, mm -hmm, nice enough. Um, say what? Um, sir? And ma'am? I was just asking if they worked in stocks or something. Uh, well, one of my, one of my cousins is a stock breaker. Something like that. I guess so. The rest of my family live like aristocrats because of that. Most of them are in the stock mar market and the rest are in retail or something. And yeah, what whatever I make her Instagram. <laughs> stock breaker? Missing blue shirt. Dark blue shirt. You are speaking up, are you? Excuse me, miss. Can yeah. you hear me? Yes, I do. 
I just said earlier that it seems like you get around to a lot of places. Yep, yes I do, ma'am, yes I do. Go around to a lot of places. Hey, hey, Jason, uh, yes, I've, been, yes, I've, been, I've been meaning to ask you since you walked in. Did you, did your mammy give you that shirt? Did I what? Your Clean. mammy. Oh, no, sir, I bought this shirt myself back in Texas. Oh, that's how they dress out there. What's wrong with this shirt? Oh, that's... I, don't see. I, I thought it was from his mammy. That's all. Oh, uh, well, it ain't my mother's... My shirt, uh, though. It's a nice shirt. shirt. I've seen, uh, Thanks, sleeves sir. rolled up like that. Yes, well, no. press. That, that just looked like something, you know, uh, a mother Hell would yeah. give her, her son, you know? Yeah. Kind of asshole. asshole. Well, I like poke dots. And I guess I should leave too. Oh no, yes, you're, you're fine. I mean, hmm. for a woman. I don't know. I don't know a lot of people. What the hell is that supposed to mean? I think I'm that saying. means you want to see you naked. What? what? I'm that's, that's, with you. That's a I'm bit of a stretch. That's a bit I, of a stretch. I'm pulling yeah. your leg. Here. Come on I, now. I think you, yeah, she, you're really stretching for that. I think I think she got a man courting her right now. I, I wouldn't. Yeah, I won't be surprised, like she did. Yeah, well, well. Yeah, I won't be surprised. God damn, these people, man. Right, right, right there, Miss Morgan. You do got a man courting. You. Yes, I do. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Make sure no one tries to mess with you. Exactly. No. Yep. Yep. Well, well, who's the lucky gentleman? If I may so ask. Well, oh. anybody. I'm assuming it's a Mr. Morgan. Me, I have this. Oh, shit. You're sticking oh, that up so in your ass. And I have oh, this. Hell. Oh, shit. Oh, hell. So, yeah, don't mess with me. So, you just married to your guns or you married to an actual man? Just kind of curious. I off. am not married. No, oh. Courtney. Court and that's leading to marriage. Yeah, yeah. Ah, I, looked, I see. I, I, see, I looked I see. it up. What the fuck? Yeah. Or courting or wooing, however you want to say. Oh, I like Fucking? that. What? I'm pulling your leg, miss. I'm pulling your leg. Well, why don't you pull Clarence's leg? <laughs> no, 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 no. No man pull anything on me. If a man ever touches me, he's as good as dead. Well. Uh, you fellas seen the uh, post board recently and how that one uh, mysterious looking fella left a note on it? Nah, actually, I can't say I, I'm not I've sure looked at it. There's a bunch of notes up there, but I don't yeah, usually was... see who posted you know it. <laughs> Alright, enough of that shit. What is this? Oh, that's hotel. Yo, thanks for the bits. How you doing tonight? <clears throat> is uh, Mr. Clarence always so rough? Sometimes the horse, they just need uh, the more love. Let me pat him. Oh, yes. The, the horse is here, I find, always very angry. Yeah, I think I might uh, take him to the stables. Let him talk with other horses or whatever they do. Yeah, the horse is the, the interesting creature. I don't much like him, to be perfectly honest. A big this is why bike. I always like to use the uh, the buggy. Oh, yeah. Would you like to see my my carriage? Uh, no. Uh, no thanks. Sorry. I'm gonna go. Uh, go for a walk. Okay, sir. You have a good evening.
on the report that we have against, you know, Mr. Diamond. The hell? God damn. The fucking door didn't want to open. Oh, but they have the electricity here. It's just freaking awesome looking. Can I go in the door? No, okay. Seems everything here is the, uh, the calm now. Okay, I may, I may put something down on my clipboard. No, no, bi Hell. business. Only business. We, we, we just see each, she's a big business leader okay. and I'm a big business leader. My and, knife uh, well, is slowly <laughs> sliding out of the... No, yeah. You know no, we're no. pulling your leg, miss. You know that. Oh, no, I ain't pulling nothing. I mean, I, I know, but I, I have constantly been to, about. I have been sex. asking Miss Morgan. I have wanted to <laughs> just reach hey, out I'm and pull one I of those like curls, though. Fun. I apologize. You better not, Clarence. I know, but you just looking at it, no. it's like I just want to pull no. one back and see if no. it springs back into place. It it's will. Just so Oh, yeah. I know it and will. Then That's I'll why. spring back and give you a back slap. I know you would. That's why I haven't done it. It'd be rude <laughs> of me to even. But I had to let you know. Just looking at your curls, I just want to pull one of them. Just <laughs> ah, all right, all right. I'll let it down. I'll let it, it down. ain't right to mess with women's hair, fella. Hey, this I seems like uh, the, the good way to have to visit me. Hey, what'd you say, fella? I say mess messing with the. Uh, Mademoiselle's uh -huh. hair would be a good way to visit the doctor. Doc, doc. For one, Doc, you don't have to speak up. You still got a little uh, gargle in your throat as well. <clears throat> uh, messing with the Mademoiselle's yeah, hair would be uh, a good way to have to visit the doctor. <laughs> yeah. Maybe. You have to come over here with me. Come here. Come here. <clears throat> All right. See, uh, back in Pennsylvania, where I used to live, um, you know, uh, they used to say, I'm, I'm really good at helping people speak, right? So, uh, go ahead. Start trying to correct your vocal cords, and I'll help you out there. Uh, this better? Uh, you're louder now, but you still got a gargling going on. Mm, that may just be the, uh, virus. Is it your, uh, your tonsils, I think they call them? You can't do nothing about your tonsils. Don't you walk off. Don't no, walk off. Um, I, was, yeah, yeah. I was getting in the corner to talk out of character for a second. No, 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 there's no reason. To. It's just, I'm going to help. Does it, does it do it with this it. voice as well, or is it just the other voice I'm using? Uh, it's every time you're talking. It's just uh, cracking. Hold on, let me try something. Yeah. I mean, I can do voice impressions too. You want to hear my? Hello, voice? hello. Hi. My name's Clarence. I've been saving that one for the Fontana. Seems they got some type of, uh, you know, uh, what they call that uh, talent shit. 
Hello. I'm just gonna make fun of Domino Douglas. <laughs> Hi, I'm Domino Douglas. I make all the money in the association of gaming, and I don't pay nobody. And then I leave everybody to get shot up for my actions. Nah, is this any better? Mm, you're still cracking. Mm, hold on. By the way, how do I sound? Do I sound like just a smooth operator, you know? <clears throat> yeah, it's not bad, actually. Okay. I mean, I, I spend enough money on the, uh, the liquid that goes down my throat. I mean, shit. Is this any better? It's getting there, but you still got a, a bit of crack in there. God damn it, I bet I need a fucking new cable. Oh, cable car, huh? Yeah, those those goddamn contraptions. Alright, how's this one? No, you're still still cracking. Do y'all hear my voice cracking or what? Don't worry. I got time. I'm here for you. One, two, three. Hello. Is this the way that you would say? <clears throat> All right, how this? Almost got worse. Can you just clear all the stuff out your throat, take everything off, and just give it to me raw? Uh, of course, I'm talking about your voice, not 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 anything else. Okay, and this? Mm, nah, still the crack. Keep, t uh, t give me a two sentences. The lazy brown fox did not jump over the fence. Yeah, yeah, hey, you cracking all the way. Is your jaw connected to your? Your head set? No, my jaw is hanging. Mm, okay. Hmm. I've neutralized all positions. All right, give it to me another sentence. The bodies would not hit the floor if there was no dancing. Mm. You got a you got a bit of attic, bit of attic in, in there. If you give me one more sentence. The lights were lit dimly to set the mood. Yeah, shit, you're still cracking. Hmm. Have you updated your, uh, your, your throat moisture? <laughs> Get all that salty, uh, all that salty stuff out so you can chat rat.
because it sounds like there's no, nothing you're doing has changed anything. So I'm thinking maybe just staying updated with all the throat moisturizing techniques at the doctor's office. Um, making sure you strip all, you know, all that meat and stuff out your teeth and, uh, and just give it to people straight and, you know, project your voice. Uh, but you coming out good. It's just, uh, it's no way to describe it, but it's just cracking every, uh, every so often where it's noticeable. Okay, the quick brown fox jumped over the fence. It's getting there. It's getting there. Hold on. Let me uh just come around. This like, hey, Clarence. All right. I'm going to come out the door and you just be like, hey, Clarence. All right. Hey, hey Clarence. How you doing? Ah, oh, shit. Yeah, he still got some cracking. Yeah. <laughs> shit. Yeah, I don't think nothing has changed. Yeah, my, uh... My local phonograph doesn't have that, so I wonder what's going on. You know what it might be? I'm hearing... I'm hearing a little extra when you're talking. And that might be amplifying and adding to the problem or maybe even making it. So, doctor usually recommends some type of uh, what they call uh, maybe, a, maybe a filter or something or, or ah, shit. You know what? I can't for the life of me think of what the problem is. No, no filters. Okay, some of this good stuff in my hair. Um, let's see. One moment. The quick brown fox jumped over the fence. The quick brown fox jumped over the fence. The quick brown fox jumped over the fence. I believe this may just be a uh, a problem to do with saltiness. Yeah, yeah. It, it, doctor says you get some salt out your diet. Um, usually, uh, usually that helps. Um, just being updated with the recommended uh, the levels that you should intake you know yeah but because you know, uh 
I checked my local radio broadcast and there is no issue. You know what it sounds like? It sounds like you're down in Saint uh, uh, Blackwater Saloon, and then um, somebody's at uh, Bastille Saloon, and they and they someone tries to call from that telephone booth, and then the other one calls uh, to the ba Bastille, right? And it's uh, you know, them, yeah, what do they call it? Uh, when you're talking, I guess the connection is getting uh, um, it's jumping every so often it's uh I don't, I don't know this technology stuff i guess they say cracking that's the only thing i can think about all right yep even just right there on that short answer you still get it Can you say ah for me? Ah. All right, now just keep holding your mouth open. <clears throat> All right, now now say ah, uh, say ah uh, again, and then keep uh... holding your mouth open. All right, now give me a give me a sentence. The horse was angry and kicked its owner in the face. No, it's getting better. It's getting better. It's not horrible. It's just a bit noticeable. All right, do this. Uh, talk to me from there. The horse was angry and kicked hey, the person. Hey, get off that horse. Hey, get off that horse. Uh, you might need to speak up, though. Get off of the horse. Yep, it's still coming through airy. Airy and then a crack. But I hear if you go to the doctors and you put in um I guess they have some type of system, a ticket system, and you put your you know what your problem is, there's a lot of good professionals that can help you. I mean I mean, I'm, I'm, I've considered myself, you know, to know, have basic knowledge of what the doctors do there, but I am by no means and no expert in any area. <laughs> but, however, I work with Haskins Death Disposal, so I do get to see a dead body every now and then. And I can only say, it seems like your, your assault levels are correct. It seems like your... I don't know. I really don't know. The best thing I can say is putting in a, you know, a support to get at the doctors and uh, the professionals can very much help you out. All if right. you want, if you look for that type of assistance. Now, right now, you're good to go. It ain't, it ain't something where someone's going to slap, slap the mess out of you and want to be away from me or nothing. But just, uh, you know, if you want to get that uh, looked at, you know, they're always there to help. All right. Yeah. But it say what was your name again? Uh you uh, a doctor or or a Yes, my name is Dr. Rotorio Leroy. Oh my goodness. Dr. Matoyo Minoy. Did I get that right? Dr. Minoy Minoy. I just say fast so I don't have to dedicate dedicate my uh, you know all my 
my tongue and my my teeth to try, to try to say that. Retoy your manure. All right. Leroy. Leroy. Retoy your Gotcha. I gotcha. Uh, you could call me Doc. Yeah. Doc. I got that. I got that one. I tell you what, Doc. Dr. McKenna, who works uh, sometimes out at our office, I guess they all traveling doctors. Um, you tell him what? Don't try to skip the undertaker. There's a process here in this state, and well, you just can't take him up to the church. There's no holes dig it up there, and there's nobody to give him a proper burial. So that's what my job is: is to conduct those services, reach out to the families if there's any, and uh, get those unclaimed bodies out of town. I don't know. They say my voice you is clipping. Dead people, you just uh, look up Clarence Haskins. Haskins death disposals is always at your service. All right, Doc. All right. Thank you very much, sir. All right, no problem. You put in that um, you put in that uh, that uh, support ticket if uh, you want someone to look at that. All right. All right. Or, so many thanks to I you. To do, I practice it in the mirror. I I say, you know, I go in the mirror and I'm like, plants. Oh, here, I'll show you right here. I say, Clarence, you the baddest motherfucker I know. Ain't nobody fucking with you today, you know? Yeah, I got the motherfucking silver tongue, girl. Come over here. <laughs> hey, uh, yeah, girl, I'll, I'll eat that thing up. What you, what you talking about? Come on, you want to cry on Clarence's shoulder? Come on over. So I I practice my, what I'm going to say to people, how I'm going to say it, you know? Who the, you know, and, and people talk shit. I said, get your ass Oh, he says my voice is cracking, but I don't hear it when I go to test it, so I don't know. Yeah, you'll get it right before I come out of that hotel and start bumping my gums, all right? All right. All right, now. Well, you take care, Doc. You see any dead people, my wagon's on the side of the sheriff's department at any time, all right? Okay, thank you very much, sir. All right, Doc. And uh, let me give you a gift. Mm, like two people said it. There you go. Some water for your throat. <laughs> Clarence Haskins. Always looking out for people. Doing God's work. <laughs> Thank you, sir. No problem now. I mean, my voice doesn't sound like it's clipping, does it? Does my voice sound like it's clipping to you right now? Crackling and popping. Yeah, I don't know. I could go over here. And I go to the capture. Begin test. One, one two, two, three. One, one two, two, three. One, one two, two, three. three. One, one, two, three. Two, one, two, two, three. three. One, one, two, two three. three. One, One, two, two three. three. Hello. Oh. Greetings. One, One two, two, three. three. Hello. Oh. Huh. Dude, I don't fucking know, man. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Hi there. Um, greetings. How you do this day? You know the best way to prepare a drink is put coffee grounds in the water. Why well, is coffee very good for the stamina? Yeah. Anyway, I'll 
see you later. Okay. Hear nothing wrong. One, two, three. 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 Hello. One, two, three. How are you doing? Hello, how are you? Greetings. Greetings. How are you? All right, whatever. Hello, I don't know what to do. One, two, three. Fuck, dude. I don't know. Man, it's fuck. I go over here and shit sounds fine. One, two, three. How are you doing? What you need to add in is Clint Haston's got a job to do, and if you keep bumping the old gums, you're going to end up in the back of his wagon. Your line of duty there, Lawman. No, it's not. Actually, it's not. It's <laughs> not at all. Blackwater. Blackwater. Yeah, try to pick them up for now. Um, otherwise, there's a nice delivery driver down by the stables. Just south in town, just south out of town, right over by the rail I house there. I do got one tip for you there, fella. Uh, you want to be careful. But this is a dangerous job. Uh, in between here and Blackwater, there's uh, been known some, uh, some Indian robbery. Man. You happen to catch him alive, you bring him back here, and, the, and you know if he tried to rob you, that is, of course, you just don't go hunting for no Indian. Man. And besides, but, besides what the the yokel officers got down there for the uh, for the bounties. Any bounties that we do place, they are uh, alive. There ain't no dead or alive. It's yeah, alive. Yeah, yeah. So that, that's what he's saying. Wait, wait, that's wait, the wait, hardest. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, so what you're telling me is, if I take the bounty, I gotta bring it back in alive. Yep, that's why it's challenging. Well, that's well, why you get good pay well, for it. Well, all I'm saying is, shit, they better, they better give me some hazard pay or something. Full, I mean, goddamn. You get damn. the full pay for the bounty if they come back alive. If they come back not alive, then it's uh, a lesser amount. Boy, oh, you might. Totally, totally, totally. Here, come here, come here. <laughs> there, Chris makes my voice popping. Well, uh, I take it you. I hear you. I you well, right people in this RP server keep saying that my fucking voice is crackling. Uh, maybe it's better off you don't bring them back. You know, don't Try talking for a bit. Hang on. The quick bound frogs jumped over the fence. Well, I mean, uh, I'm, I'm, 
I'm, I'm in it for the money. So besides no, being you, a fine. bounty hunter, which is uh, my career of choice, no, no. okay. What, what's so, the way for a man to make some money around here? I'm sorry for getting it. Again, it could be well, something well, real in quick, the game. Before that conversation goes on, so uh, he was clarifying for the, the bounty work in uh, yeah, so Blackwater and Rhodes. You can bring them, bring them dead, but for our bounties, you got to bring them alive. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay, I get what you're saying. So basically, those the ones that you get from the office is just those uh those those, those troublesome yokels. bandits. Yeah, yep, the, the, the yokel bandits. But but the ones that the ones that you guys want is, is the the famous outlaws, the ones that's out there yeah. committing them crimes and doing all those bad things, especially that damn engine. I mean, I ain't got no no problem with the engines, but I mean, shit, they robbing innocent people. Oh, what are I, you doing there, boy? We, 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 I, well. But yeah, that's uh. But currently, right now, um, I don't think we really have anything because we just got a whole bunch of new deputies coming through. We don't really need uh any bounty hunters running around, and we gotta make sure the deputies are all well trained and well well prepared, and then yeah. we'll uh, more than likely roll out the uh the bounty hunters and stuff like that. Hey, and, uh, take make sure you go check with the state office. Uh, Offices, uh, usually the judiciary or else the government itself that will be rolling out some information soon enough about the bounty hunter licensing. Okay, yeah. okay, that that makes sense. So, uh, uh, like I said, uh, me and me and my me and my associate over here, I just met him. To, uh, we just wanted to know is uh, what's going on in these towns. I heard Valentine was a pretty booming spot. And, oh uh, yeah, if you in the I dead body that, business man. like I am, shit, it's definitely depends booming. on what you I, I will, is, uh, I, booming. Yeah, and here I'll tell you this now: there's already this town already has a lot of want to be vigilantes and already want to be bounty hunters as is, and I'll arrest your ass if you try and do anything. Um, so, you know, you want to try and keep the most civil legal work you can do. I mean, yeah, you can do those bounty hunters out in uh, in roads and Blackwater, but uh, besides that, if you see a deputy around, we got it. We don't need anyone's help necessarily unless you're deputized. Yeah. Well, well, there uh, is one place. I, I, there is one yeah, place if you're looking for legal work. Not. You know, yeah, I don't want to just be uh, anyway. name dropping here, but uh, yeah, Catherine Field and Company is always hiring good men. Life if you, you never been behind bars, and uh, well, you uh, on the. Uh, uh, I gotta sit down with Mr. Catherine Field pretty soon here. Oh. Yep, any good experience? You know, they they help with the governor as well. Get the mm -hmm. hell off the roof. Uh, yep. You'll Caught two, two engines the other day. Red, red dog and swift arrow out in uh, New Austin. Tried to attack the governor himself. We protected oh. him at all costs. You know, I'll, <laughs> let, I'll let you have your limelight. Yeah, he caught two. Well, um, uh, well, yeah. uh, so. Good catches. Funny you speak about that, Mr. Uh, Haskins. I was the judge who, uh, put those two gentlemen to jail. Well, but, congratulations there, judge. Let's see how, uh, the law. And a security company, and the government, and the judges all working together. <laughs> See, Shit. that's right, what so I call teamwork. If you want decent legal work, it ain't fun, but you definitely do make some good money. Honestly, because I did it myself and I was bored as hell. Chopping some wood makes some pretty good. <coughs> get your arms nice strong, get your tit. Damn good. It honestly does pay pretty good, and the time so, flies by really fast. Uh, do you make had yourself had about. Two hundred dollars in one sunset. For some, uh, uh, some working girls. Oh, a brothel. <laughs> yeah, now that's what I'm talking about. But it's, we this damn state is too many people with too many damn ideas. I, I tell you what, Keen Saloon <laughs> is a good one. A lot of traffic here, and uh, well, nah, I, I, that place I, I, needs some horse well, up you in make it. Make sure you I, tell I, your cousin take a look at the government. Uh, <laughs> Head over to the government um, office and uh, ask about it through there. Peruse through the uh, through the regulation guide. See what uh, is available for that. Well, I, I think I think I don't think he wants to work in Keens. I think he's gonna take himself over to uh, Saint Denis or something and make make a nice little establishment or something over there. But uh, oh yeah. yeah, all right now. Yeah. Sounds like an interesting idea. Moving on up. There you go. You know, uh, I got I got light red coat. No, no, oh, no, oh, hey, okay, why is he? Hey, hey. Maybe I have the business here soon. Okay, all right. You know what? That's fine. Oh, 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 oh. No, no, don't, don't laugh him. Hey, he wants to rap. He wants to go with the deputy. Get back. What do you mean? He want to swing on me. I'll just take care of the problem. 
And you, sir, have been served. Somebody was on the local. Somebody cleaned the bathroom. Excuse me, Oh, yeah. Thank you. I appreciate it. You ain't got no. Mm, this one probably just needs to sleep it all. Oh, yeah, 100%. He needs to sleep it all. Probably got a little bit more booze in him. Mm, this uh, new this citizen, or are you doctor? local? Yes, sir. My name Dr. Rotario. Pleasure to meet you. Name's Deputy Seth DeVille. Uh, I'll just say when he wakes up, tell him to get the hell out of town. Mm, all right, no problem for you. All right, pleasure meeting you. You as well, my friend. How are you doing with this, sir? Mm, very well, and you? Oh, very well. So, uh, you, uh, you a doctor? Yes, sir. Oh, you the town doctor here? Mm, for the moment. Oh, all right. Well, I'm also a doctor as well. A dentist, if you will. Mm, not too many people here know what the dentist is. Yeah, I'd say the same thing, but it's a very important uh, part of the job. It's, a, it's one of the things where you, you, you absolutely need a dentist around to keep your teeth clean. Otherwise, you just might die. Now, you, you, when was the last time you got your teeth cleaned? Mm, that's how I think I took care of my teeth, being a physician. Well, that's good. That's good. Well, do, do, as a physician, do you have any? <clears throat> do you have any spare teeth uh, to donate? Mm, no. Every now and then, you know, I must uh, carve some dentures for someone, but. Uh, uh, Mr. Claire in South Front, he, he takes care of bodies. He may have something for you. He might have some bunch of teeth then from the dead bodies. Is that what you're saying? Is that uh, what you're saying? Yes, from what he said, he'd like to dismember so he can fit more bodies in his buggy. Well, I'm proud of myself. Uh, my name is Dr. Uh, Finkel Einhorn. And, uh, I just, uh, w what's yours? Dr. Rotorio Leroy. Leroy. Well, what's the specialty, Dr. Leroy? General practice in surgery. G general practice in surgery. All right. Well, I'm a traveling dentist, so I'm just coming through. I didn't realize you were already stationed here. That's that's completely fine. I'll refer all the general practice and surgeries to you. However, if anyone comes in with a, with a loose tooth or anything, send it to me. That way I can snag it and add it to my... To my collection mm, sort of like a uh, real life tooth fairy well, I, I you would not call me a, a fairy there sir i resent that mm, not in uh character but uh the tooth fairy love collecting the teeth and oh uh, yes i also offer services of replacing the teeth as well uh five dollars per tooth and then ten dollars for <clears throat> For every gold tooth. Okay. Uh, may I ask where you get your uh, your spectacles? They're very reflective. Uh, I believe I got that in Saint Denis. Well, they're very shiny. Yeah, I like yours uh, very well as well. Well, I'm gonna uh, Doctor Lavoy. <clears throat> I'm gonna just make my way around town and introduce myself, see if anyone has some teeth for sale. Some loose teeth. But yes, I would uh, check with uh, the Mr. Clarence, the uh, the loud man talking with the uh, deputy. All right, yeah, Mr. Clarence. Sounds good. Thank you. Oh, I forgot to mention. I, I pay yes, sir? At least, I pay at least $1 per tooth as well. Okay. Just keep that mind. Just keep that mind. Shh. Son, take the hat off. He's five, it's not tackled, it's an ass beat. Oh, there you go. Alrighty, well, I'm gonna, really much I'm, like I'm, I'm gonna head out of here. What's your problem, uh, friend? Mr. Haskins, it was a pleasure. Judge, hey. deputy, it was also a pleasure. Yeah, hey, you um, take care now. Mr. Mascot, like I said, if you see any, if you see any people, if you see any people with masks and they try to give you any money, don't take it. That's what I personally would do it. I mean, if somebody is wearing a mask, they typically ask for your money, but 
Well, I, I mean, I'm, I was just saying if someone, if someone, if someone, if someone nope, if someone, nope, nope, oh, yep, yeah, 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 yeah,